This morning, we're taking a good look at the Neglected Tropical Diseases Program, which is one that's running here in Ghana, focusing on a number of uh, diseases, well over 20 diseases. But the program in itself just focuses on five out of all of these uh, neglected diseases, elephantiasis, river blindness, bilharzia, worms, and trachoma. Well, the, you know, national, uh, pardon me, the... NTD, which is the Neglected Tropical Diseases, are celebrating their World NTD Day and is happening at the end of this month. And so we're getting into it, understanding the whole trajectory, how far they've come and what we should expect from the program in the coming uh, days. And so uh, uh, I'm joined by Dr. Benjamin Marfo, who's a program manager at the Neglected, Disease, uh, Neglected Tropical Diseases here in Ghana. You're welcome to the New Day. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right, great. I understand that you're celebrating your World NTD Day. Sure. For how long have you been uh, celebrating this? Oh, this is the, 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 the first of its kind. Oh, yeah, lovely. Yeah. All right. So for those who don't even know what neglected diseases are, even though I said a little bit about it, can yes. you just expand so, it for us? So, yes. So thank you very much for the question. <laughs> Basically, neglected tropical diseases are a group of uh, infectious and parasitic diseases um, found in the most impoverished parts of the world. Mm. Globally, there are 20 right. worldwide. And then in Ghana, we have 14. 14? 14. Okay, one 14. four. I was scared four. you were saying 40. Yeah, no, no. Be crazy. One, one four. <laughs> <laughs> yes, in Ghana, right. there are 14. Uh, so we have elephantiasis. Mm. We have um, rub blindness. Mm. Um, intestinal worm infestation. Mm. Bilharzia. Trachoma, mm. which has already been eliminated. Right. If you remember, sometime back in um, 2018, yeah. we also have um, Borrelia ulcer, mm. um, yours. Yes, yours as well. Yes, yes. We have uh, leprosy, mm. um, yeah. guinea worm yes, disease, true. which has also, also been el eliminated. Um, right. We also have sleeping sickness. Yes. We have leishmaniasis, mm -hmm. scabies, rabies. Wow snake bite and phenomenon right. so basically yeah there are around 14 thereabouts but why, why do we call them the neglected yes we neglected because diseases. right now from the community level to the policy level mm. the disease is neglected uh, persons having NTDs mm -hmm. are, are persons of little voice okay. marginalized right. they find themselves marginalized and they are not able to uh, project whatever they have right. in, in mind and uh, so they cannot speak for themselves. Right. They are seriously, uh, seriously, they are stigmatized, okay. and um, they can't say much for themselves. And for for a long time, we all went asleep on uh, entities, on thinking yeah. that somehow they they were not reversed. Mm. And so even when it comes to public public health activities, policymakers sometimes tend to um, forget ab about um, these diseases. diseases. So they are neglected. Uh, right down from the community level to the top. To the top. Yes, yes. And you mentioned, uh, you know, that they've, uh, it happens in these other areas, that it happens in the rural areas yes, and uh, urban slums as well. Yes, what sure. is the correlation between the NTDs and poverty? Yes, so w poverty fuels uh, uh, NTDs. How? And the other way around also. How? Yes, so um, when uh, uh, you find yourself in uh, impoverished uh, areas, Yes. First of all, you sanitation mm -hmm. becomes so poor, okay. so bad, and when you have bad sanitation, that fuels many of the diseases okay. like trachoma, bilharzia, yes. blah blah blah. Mm. You, you don't have a um, good source of uh, drinking water, so intestinal worm infestation. Oh, right. So etc. So you find that when you have when when you, wherever there's poverty, mm. things go bad. And they have some um, many of these diseases. Worldwide, we are talking about over one billion people hmm. uh, wow. at risk of yeah. uh, uh, NTDs. NTDs, and that's about one seventh of the population. Mm. Yes, it, it's quite devastating. So, so, looking at this, you mentioned that guinea worm uh, infestation is out. Yes, and there's um, trachoma, trachoma, which is also out. out. Leprosy too has also been eliminated. Really? Yes, and um, wait, is leprosy curable? Yes, so if, 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 if you have leprosy and you, uh, you are seen at the uh, health facility at, yes. an, at the early stage, yes. Oh, okay, yes, okay. At the early stage, because yes. I know there are some people who have leprosy but and they are still around. Yes, you yes, know, yes. So but many of them at that stage, they are not, they are not even infectious. But, they, okay. but then they come with the sequelae of 
the leprosy sometimes with their fingers yes. in that state. So they can't the, infect in, anybody in else? Fingers. Yes. It's in the early stages, stages that they can yes, infect? Okay. Yes, basically. All right. So leprosy mm. is also out. Out, oh, yes. Um, can we get a current update? We're, we're still working on in, the disease may be, may be eliminated, but there's several ones. Okay. Ongoing, so that at least in case of incidental cases, mm. the health system will be able to pick. Okay, sure. Yes. sure. Uh, we are thinking yeah, that in the next couple of years, mm. uh, elephantesis will also be eliminated. Mm. Uh, what are you doing uh, towards you know getting that out of the system? Oh, yes, so that's what we do communities. annually. We, we, we go to communities, uh, communities mm -hmm. and then we administer uh, medicines, okay. what we call the mass drug administration. Drug. Sometimes we do, every year we come here yeah. to, to talk about mass drug administration. That's what we do. The whole idea is that we give, we give the drugs that will be able to kill the worms. Mm. Um, elephantiasis is caused by worms. Yes. Transmitted through the bites of mosquitoes. Mosquitoes. Yes. So, first of all, sanitation so we don't have mosquitoes around, yeah. um, indoor residual spraying, ITNs, cystitated bed nets, and then we give a uh, mass drug administration every year. So okay. in case you have the worm in you, the, this, uh, the, the drugs will kill, will kill the them. Yes. I see. Yes. And so um, we, we've spoken about a, a few of these. Um, Bill what, what is what else is, uh, how, how can you describe the Bill current ha state yes, of ND, N, uh, NCDs, aside, you know, the ones that you've already mentioned here in Ghana? Yes, so... I've mentioned that so far, elephantiasis. Yes. We started with 98 endemic uh, districts. Okay. And currently, as I speak, we are left with uh, 15. Okay. So we have broken transmission Down. in 83. That's amazing. Yeah. Yes. And I'm, I'm, I'm taking the next couple of years, we should be able to, uh, we'll be in the process of uh, <laughs> eliminating uh, Eliminate or, or breaking tr uh, tr transmission. On uh, river blindness, we have uh, 120 districts that are endemic. Okay. We are still treating. Okay. We go into communities and we give the mass drug administration. Uh, Bilhazia and intestinal worm infestation is still under the control program, mm. whereby we still advise on sanitation, etc. Yeah. Et and then the fact that we need to have um, good water sources. Exactly. Um, and then we also do school mass drug administration. We okay. go into community because the children are much more vulnerable. That so we go, in, we go into uh, schools and we administer uh, medicines every now and then. Trachoma has been eliminated. So basically, um, we are not there yet, but <laughs> we, we've, we've had some achievements. Well, that's, that's good news, yes, actually. We, we've had that's some achievements. Yeah. Practically, what are some of the things that some of us also can do? And, uh, you know, I can do those in the rural areas and mm. all some of us in the urban areas as well. What can we do practically to eliminate? Yeah, so we need to uh, encourage um, the intake of the medicines when it comes to the annual uh, mass drug administration. Okay. Yes, we, ha we all have to uh, participate. Okay. Like uh, So, uh, as I said, as we take the medicines, these medicines kill the worms. The worms, exactly. Yes. And then it helps. So the worms do not... Um, develop, develop to become uh, adult worms, mm -hmm. and then it comes with uh, the sequelae of swollen legs, sometimes swollen scrotum, etc. Et we mm -hmm. do not want that because exactly. it's quite it's, it's quite devastating. Indeed, it's quite indeed. devastating. And healthcare is not it's, it's not that easy to, to yes, you know. Yes, yes. Like out. I said, many of these persons are poor. Yeah. And they, by virtue of the fact that they have these these uh, diseases, also the disease. The disease itself fuels yeah. and enhance, enhances the poverty. Because once you have the disease, you are not able to go to work. Exactly. You are not able to mm -hmm. run your chores or whatever. And then your poverty uh, gets worse. Yeah. yeah, It's quite expensive. So as we tackle NTDs indirectly, we are tackling uh, and responding to poverty the in poverty the country. poverty as well. The, the as well. Kudos to you. Yeah. Now, the Ghana Health Service uh, you know, has announced that we're celebrating the sure, World sure. NCD mm, Day yeah. on 30th Th yes, uh, that, January. Yeah, yeah. Yes, can that's you tell us a bit? That's tomorrow, yes. So, so, <laughs> yes. <laughs> and we started here. last weekend, uh, Saturday, there was a health walk okay. from um, um, Kolebu through some of the principal streets of Accra okay. to the Ghana Health Service headquarters at Tama Station. Okay. And we still, we've been having a health uh, radio and TV talk shows exactly. up, like, like I'm this, doing now. Exactly. Today we'll be, we'll be we are doing a media encounter, okay. and we'll, we'll, we'll talk to the media about NTDs, okay. and then tomorrow will be the uh, the D day, the, the lunch. The yes, D day. And, uh, yes, and I'm, I'm I'm excited. Yes, yes, Tell because us more. It, yes, yes, because it's an awareness creation, okay. advocacy, 
Okay. This is a time to educate the public about what, what NTDs are, yeah. and, to, and to remind the public that NTDs are still with us, okay. but we can do something okay. um, about, about, the, about the diseases. About the diseases. Mm, yes. Um, so, so at the end of the day, what would you want the public to also do, um, you know, as part of your celebrations? Of Good. So, like I said, we will, we, will, we will inform the public what NTDs are, okay. and to inform them, that, for instance, that every year we do come into communities to administer medicines mm. and they need to participate. Do you take volunteers? Yes, we make it's, it's, the volunteers do that. The okay. health workers train the volunteers okay. and the volunteers go into the community's house, house to house yeah. and administer the medicines. So it's important that we all participate. Okay. We all participate. The, the medicines are safe and they are good. Okay, so where's yes. the launch happening though? The launch, launch is happening at Manchabuena, uh, Jamestown in Accra, okay. tomorrow. Oh, beautiful. Yes, 9.30 a.m. A.m.? Yes, 9.30 okay. a.m. And so we, we, I'm taking the opportunity to invite <laughs> you, you, you and your... Uh, I'm sure uh, the yes. house would be there sure, as sure, well. Sure. Thank you so much, yeah, most, uh, Dr. Benjamin Marfo. Do you have any special thanks to go around before we leave? Do I? Have any special thanks? Anyone you'd yes. like to thank? Yes, uh, well, we, uh, I need to take the opportunity to thank our sponsors, mm -hmm. our partners, USAID, mm -hmm. UKID, um, the BHO, mm -hmm. um, Act to End, NTDs West, World Vision, FHI 360, mm. um, Water, Water Aid, and a host of site savers, yeah. and a host of others. Uh, and, expe and we also have to thank the, our teachers, okay. Ghana okay. Education Service. Up this yes, because when it comes to school, the women, they mm. really assist us a lot and a yeah, and, and host of others. Wonderful. Yeah. Thank you so much. And I wish you all the best with the rest of uh, the project Most as well. Uh, Dr. Benjamin Marfo is the program manager at the Neglected Tropical Diseases uh, Program. Thank you for joining us.